Hi there, I'm Johnny, and today I'm going to show you the creme de la creme of the pan world. Le Creuset have been around for generations, and quite frankly, there is nothing better on the market. So this is the 26 centimeter square grill. It's one of the most iconic pans to have ever been created, in my opinion. Fun fact, my grandma had one of these from before I was born and it's still going strong today and I'm well over 30 now. So this was technology beyond its time. It's got an authentic grill pattern and the grooves keep the fat away from the frying material. This for me is where Le Creuset have modernized with the times. This is a 28 centimeter tough and non-stick square grill with its long ergonomic handle. The rib surface creates a char grill lines that add the flavor and texture to food. The non-stick coating is ideal for more delicate food to like your fish, your salmon, your sea bass, your cod. However, it is absolutely perfect for meat and poultry too. So this for me is my favorite pan. This is the 32 centimeter rectangular grill. And I'm gonna tell you why it's my favorite. Yes, it has the authentic grill pattern. Yes, it has the grooves that keep the fat away from the frying material. Yes, it's amazingly flat, so it's perfect for storage. However, the game changer for me is you can cook on different temperatures on different sides. So you can have one side hot and one side cooler. For me, that's the game changer. So this is the toughened non-stick 35 centimeter rectangular grill. It's got a slightly sloped surface to allow all the oils and juices to flow away from the food. The generous sized cooking surface is ideal for larger families and with these upright looped handles, it makes it easier for lifting and perfect for going in the oven. One of the biggest misconceptions about cast iron pans is people whack it on a high heat and think that's right. That's absolutely wrong. All Le Creuset grills need is a low to medium heat to allow the heat to build slowly and gently to prevent any hot spots. This prevents any overheating and is the main cause of sticking and burning. A couple of top tips I'll give you is always allow your meat to seal before you turn and never add pepper to your pan or it'll burn on your hot grill surface. The best way to tell whether your pan is at the correct temperature to cook is what we call the water test. If the water dissolves instantly like so, we're ready to get cooking. Cruze are that confident in their pans, you get a lifetime guarantee. But that's not for misuse, that's only for manufacturer's fault. So I'm going to show you how to take care of your pans at home after you finish cooking. So after you finish cooking anything in these pans, you have to leave them to cool until they're cold before you clean it. Then we're going to soak it in hot and soapy water for 10 minutes. Then we're going to use the nylon brush to clean the pan. So after you've scrubbed it with your nylon brush, we're gonna get a little bit of hot and soapy water with a soft scourer or sponge. I'm gonna scrub it clean. Then we're gonna pat it dry, ready for its next use. 